all is. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm just thinking of this uh, assurance of compliance and the civil rights certificate of the boys, uh, Boy Scouts. Yes. <laughs> Uh, there seems to be some problem with actually when do you have court hearings. <laughs> now, you don't require proof of service because you said that I was crazy. Yes! Mm -hmm. And you didn't require a reply and you don't strike from the docket any court hearings. You just sit there asking yourselves, well, where is everybody? <laughs> Now, for every time that you did not have a reply, you should not have been in court, Judge. Do you understand that? <clears throat> now, it looks like the county judiciaries have stopped really accounting for why the fuck you're there. Ouch! Now, when I get to suing today, because it's going to be a multi-billion dollar day, <clears throat> I, I actually did look at some of the court forms and <laughs> this whole concept of the petitioner that filed for the default um, a motion for dissolution of marriage caring about the respondent and <laughs> the fraudulent issue of a protection order where there was no proof of service in 2011. Yes, <laughs> there should never be a judge sitting on a bench where there's no proof of service. Ouch! Now, I'm going to go through the proofs of service of each and every protection order for the last 20, 25 years. <laughs> and if you were sitting on the bench because it was on the docket, you're in violation of the laws of the United States. Oh, oh, family court commissioners. <laughs> now, I did look at that uh, section 33, uh, something in the Washington State Constitution about <laughs> family law commissioners. Yes. Superior Court Commissioners uh, having the same rights as Superior Court Judges that are elected. Pooch. Unless, of course, you're going to work when it's unnecessary, you're actually using a courtroom. Ouch. And uh, the various individuals employed in that courtroom as the bailiff is standing there. Yes, it could be that those that are bailiffs could be doing something else, <laughs> maybe cleaning up the place. Ouch! Now, I know that you should not be having court hearings without proof of service. I told you that numerous times. You decided to have a court hearing on July 31st of 2015 without any proof of service to myself. Yes, at least five judicial days prior to the court hearing. Then you decided to have a dissolution of marriage where I responded. Yes, my wife filed for a default a dissolution of marriage. And then after that, you had numerous hearings where there was no reply on my part or the petitioner's part that I, as a respondent, was given the actual number of days before there were hearings. Yes. Now, without that reply, you should not be in that fucking courtroom. Now, judges oh, are costing the taxpayer what could be hundreds of millions, maybe billions. Pooch! And I'm going to get to sue on every fucking judge, every court commission. Everyone in the fucking nation! Now, you don't appear in the courtroom unless there's a reply in the file.